Hey guys, welcome back. It's KB here. In this video, I'm going to share with you guys my top 12 free PC softwares that I use and I believe everyone should also use them. Let's start this with Winget UI. This is a software which I absolutely love because using this I can download softwares for my PC plus I can check for updates for those softwares. This is actually a graphical user interface app for Winget and Scoop. So downloading softwares using this is absolutely safe. You'll find most of the most popular and free software softwares in here. Let's say for example, I'm looking for Discord. I can download Discord from here. Looking for VLC, easy VLC is here. 7-zip, it's here. As of now, in my opinion, this is even better than the Microsoft Store. Next, we have Bulk Crap Uninstaller, in short, BC Uninstaller. This is a uninstaller for PC. Using this, you can uninstall programs from your PC. Using this, you can uninstall multiple softwares at once. It will clean registry entries plus leftover files. I have used many uninstaller tools in my life, but uh, in my opinion, this is the best one and as of now, I'm using this uninstaller. This is my favorite uninstaller so far. Next, we have Neat Download Manager. This is a download manager which looks like Internet Download Manager and actually works just like Internet Download Manager. If you're looking for a absolutely free alternative for Internet Download Manager, then Neat Download Manager is the best. and Right now, this is my favorite download manager. It does almost everything what a internet download manager does. In my opinion, for free, this download manager is just absolutely amazing. You should give it a try. Next, we have Bleach Bit. This is a open source PC cleaning tool, and I have been using this from almost like two, three years now. And in my opinion, this is probably the safest PC cleaning tool out there there are a bunch of pc cleaning tools which provides many features and whatnot but if you want like the safest pc cleaning tool which won't break your pc and you know don't have too many options to confuse you go for it it is simple easy to use and it does what a pc cleaning tool should do next we have shell this is a little program which will help you to change right click menu on your windows 10 or 11. windows 11's right click menu absolutely sucks so if you're using windows 11 you have to use this it will change your windows 11 right click menu and will provide many tools in right click menu plus it also works on your taskbar. Next, we have NV Clean Stall. I use this tool to update my NVIDIA graphics drivers, plus slim down or deep load NVIDIA graphics drivers. I use this because I don't like to use NVIDIA GeForce experience because I don't use any of the features which comes with the NVIDIA GeForce experience. For example, NVIDIA Shadow Play and many other features. I don't like to use them. NV Clean Install is lightweight and it provides me the updates and I can customize my NVIDIA graphics drivers before I install them. I can basically deep load and make the NVIDIA graphics driver installation minimal lightweight nvidia graphics drivers i think you can say that so absolutely amazing tool if you're using nvidia graphics drivers and if you don't like to use nvidia geforce experience next we have dns changer this is a little program which is actually really really useful uh, i have been using this from ages now i don't even remember how long using this program you can change dns server on your windows pc with one click and without restarting your pc and it also provides you benchmarks for different dns servers and shows you which dns server is faster for you so in my case you can see cloudflare has the fastest response time which is 5.2 ms next we have traffic monitor another tiny little program which is also really helpful it shows you download and upload speed on your windows taskbar there are many options to customize this and you can also see cpu and ram usage so yeah again a little tool but really helpful next we have scrcpy plus using this tool 
I can control my phone from PC easily uh, like just few clicks and my phone will appear on my PC and I can control my phone from here easy PC this tool actually provides a graphical user interface for SCRCPY which is a another program uh, and this tool is based on that plus it provides you many other tools for your phone you can debloat your phone you can get your phone's device info and yeah this is like my favorite uh, screen mirroring tool plus phone controlling tool for windows next we have lively wallpaper using this tool you can set live wallpapers on your pc for free there is a most popular software for this called wallpaper engine which costs a little bit money but if you're looking for a absolutely free wallpaper engine alternative this is the one it's open source free and has a couple of live wallpapers that you can just use i actually have a dedicated video for this uh, you should watch that video on that video you can learn how to get even more live wallpapers for free again if you're into live wallpapers and you don't want to spend money this is the best one next we have camus this is a really 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 useful tool for me because i use webcam on my windows pc if you also have a webcam then you know one annoying thing about the webcam in windows is that whenever you restart your pc your webcam settings go back to default so you have to customize the webcam settings again when you restart your pc so to save some time i use this tool to save my webcam settings i customize my webcam settings here and save a profile and then when i restart my pc i select that profile and load the profile and my you know webcam settings gets restored in one click so if you have a webcam and you want to save your webcam settings you should try this and the final one we have becky this is a wallpaper app and i use this app to change my wallpapers yeah the wallpaper you're seeing right now is actually from the becky in my opinion this is probably the best wallpaper app for windows for mac for any device actually there is a windows app for it there is a android app for it uh, there is a ios app for it if there is no app of becky then there is a website called becky.com and you can get the wallpapers all i want to say is that this app has never disappointed me uh, whenever i want some good looking wallpaper it has always served me well and i think that's it for this one hope you enjoyed it and as always if you have any questions or have any suggestions for me you can always do the comment and we can have some chit chat in the comments too yeah that's it hope you enjoyed it i will see you in the next one take care of yourself and have fun bye bye